In the heart of Tuscany lies the town of Siena, considered one of the most beautiful towns in Italy. Here, in one of the narrowest alleys of the old town, is the Antica Osteria da Divo. Pino de Chico runs the restaurant with his wife. He's been working as the chef here for the past 13 years. Inside, the guests sit surrounded by ancient tough stone walls, some of which are actually part of Siena's old town wall. The restaurant serves traditional Tuscan cuisine. We use typical products from Tuscany. In summer, the focus is, above all, on vegetables. Zucchini flowers, basil, peppers, zucchini, and lots more. Apart from that, we use the fresh pecorino cheese from Pienza. In Pienza, one hour's drive from Siena, is the organic farm Podera y Casale. Here, Pino de Chico finds all the ingredients he needs for his dish, zucchini filled with tomato and pecorino cheese. In the garden, he looks for fresh vegetables with organic farmer Sandra Schmidig. Everything produced here is organic, and the livestock is also kept according to strict ecological standards. We've been organic farmers for 20 years. We raise sheep and goats for consumption, but we also produce cheese. For example, pecorino, a mild cheese that's traditionally made with unpasteurized sheep's milk. Tuscan pecorino is left to mature for up to about six months. Spices or herbs are often added. A kilo of organic pecorino can cost up to 23 euros here, depending on how long it has matured. For me, freshness, quality, and texture are most important. If you pay attention to these three principles, you get the best results. The vegetables are prepared first. The zucchini is sliced about two millimeters thick. Then the tomatoes are scored and briefly placed in simmering water to soften. Then they're immediately tossed together with ice cubes to cool. Pino does this so that the tomatoes remain firm, yet easy to peel. Now the pecorino and the tomatoes are cut into small pieces. Tachico drizzles olive oil on plastic sheets, lays the zucchini down, and seasons it with salt and pepper. He then covers them with tomato and pecorino slices. The rolling requires a bit of skill. A little extra cheese on top, and then they're placed in the oven for 10 minutes at 180 degrees Celsius. Meanwhile, Dechico cleans these zucchini flowers with a brush. They fry better if you don't wash them in water. He then fries the flowers in hot oil for about one minute. The finished baked zucchini rolls are served on a red pepper sauce. The flowers are placed on top and the rolls are ready for the table. A perfect light meal for a hot summer day. In summer, the squash, zucchini, and peppers are particularly fresh. That's why we only have them on the menu in summer and early autumn. Pino recommends white wine with the meal, obviously from the region, just like everything else served at the ancient Osteria da Divo.